Hello. And welcome back, ladies, gentlemen, and MBs. Thank you for tuning back into St. Andrew TV, your cure for your Monday blues. Today, we are doing another gun spinning video. And you just saw it with the intro there. We are going to do the gun flip which is you snap your wrist down to a forward spin and get it down to a position that is right in front of your dominant hip. And then you are going to release it up in the air where it will do one reverse spin and then you catch it into a firing position. Now this one is a little more demanding than the ones we have done previously. However, if I can master it, so can you. So let's get to it. No one on the corner has to work like us. Hit me on my barn a prepaid wireless. We pack and deliver like UPS trucks. Already gonna hell just pumping that gas. All I wanna do is and uh sing and I take your money. All I wanna do is and uh sing and I take your money. So the first thing we are going to do when we do this gun spinning trick is, of course, we are going to check if our firearm is free of any metallic cartridges, which it is, so we are good to go. And we are going to start from the side here, and we're going to do it real slow because this one is challenging. That is, without a shadow of a doubt, this one is a very, very challenging gun spin. I'm going to start by just showing you the basic steps. So when you snap the pistol down, it's supposed to go into a forward spin like this. And then when you get to this position here, you're going to throw it back up and it's gonna flip back and you are gonna catch it. I don't expect you to catch it by putting your finger back into the trigger guard because that might be a little dubious at best. I don't know if somebody's gonna get good enough where they can grab it and have their finger in the trigger guard. Just make sure you kind of catch it and don't throw it too far out in front of you because that's how you throw it across the room. So like I said, you go down and spin and when it gets down here, you throw it back up and you catch it just like so. Hey, that's pretty good. So from the front view, it looks a little bit something like this, where you snap it down and flip it up. And I caught it a bit weird there, but that's how we're practicing. Just like that. I would practice this above a bed frame or something with a mattress on said bed frame because uh, I did this in front of my couch so when I did drop it it hit a nice spongy surface to absorb all of the impact. Another thing I might add is when it goes up in the air a lot of you are going to want to keep your eyes on the target. Obviously that's not a practical move in a gunfight so to speak and second of all this is just for flash and this is to show off to your uh, fellow old Westians and show them that you can do some pretty cool gun spinning tricks. So watch when you throw that revolver, you're watching that revolver the entire time. You don't want to drop this. I mean, at the low end, this one cost me $450, which is not cheap. And heaven forbid you do this with an actual Colt that costs you about five times as much. Um, so you're going to want to watch that revolver when it's doing its little rotation in the air. And that about does it for the revolver flip or the gun flip, whatever you'd like to call it. You are flipping this thing in midair and it is definitely a daunting task at first. When I first saw this, I was like, do I dare try this? And uh, I did and I'm glad I did and I'm glad I got to share it with you guys today. 
Let me know what you think of the video down in the comment section. Also, if you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like, which is also down there at the bottom of the screen. And right next to that like button is a big red button that reads subscribe. I appreciate everyone who has hit that button in the past and continues to watch St. Andrew TV every Monday at noon. But for those of you who have come across this video and have yet to hit that subscribe button, think about doing so. You're a daisy if you do.